heard stories and fairy tales about witches flying on broomsticks. Where did those stories come from? Well, they started with an animal which can kill snakes, and I'm talking about toads. These toads which I have in my hand are Queensland cane toads. They're originally from South America, and they're related to the toads in Europe which witches often carried around with them and used in their brews and so on. They're very dangerous creatures, the Queensland cane toads, because they are extremely poisonous. Now, they're not aggressive, they don't have teeth, but they can kill almost any animal, and they do it because of poison glands that they have. But first of all, have a look at these two. The big one on the bottom is the female, small one on the top is the male, and they are now in the mating position. You'll notice that the male has a grip on the female. Also, you can tell the difference between them, besides size, by touching the male. And he makes that noise. Actually, it's a little signal in case another male jumps on his back, and it's to say to him, get off, I'm not a female, I'm a male. But they have poison in these glands, which you can see at the side, large swollen glands. They don't spit it out normally unless they are aggravated or troubled. And in fact, if another animal, like a dog or even a python, comes along and tries to eat the animal, it'll eject that poison, and the poison can kill almost immediately. It's not uncommon to find a python at the side of the road with one of these creatures in its mouth. The poison kills the python before the python has a chance to swallow it. Let's see if we can show this little guy ejecting some of that poison. There you can see the, you can see the little white, yellowy white substance coming out of the poison gland, and that's the substance which is extremely toxic. In fact, if you ever touch these toads, you must wash your hands very thoroughly before eating, because it can even kill human beings, or at least make them very sick. So that's the Queensland cane toad, a pest up here in northern Queensland, but it's something that explains why those witches thought they were flying. If small quantities of that are taken in, and the witches used to walk around licking toads, then hallucinations occur, and the witches thought they were flying. They really did. That's where the stories of witches on broomsticks come from. Curiosity.